master of Bible studies, a master of Bible studies, took the Bible, slammed it on the table, and said, this is our mandate. For us to know where we are, to make a connection to where we are, I need to open up to the Sefer uh, Shmuel Bet, to the book of uh, 2 Samuel, where we read over here that about uh, David and how he captured in Jerusalem. Um, one second. Okay, so for us to understand what's going on, we have to read this. I'm going to give you a rough translation. And all the tribes of Israel came to David in Hebron. They said to him, Behold, we are your flesh and blood. Yesterday and day before, when Saul was king upon us, it was you that would lead us into war and lead the battles of Israel. And God said to you, You shall be the shepherd of my people Israel, and you shall be for them the leader. And all the elders of Israel came to the king in Hebron, and they made with him a covenant. And David then, then, they, they then anointed David to be king upon all of Israel. Thirty years old was David when he rose to rule. Forty years did he rule. And Hebron he ruled on Judea for seven years and six months. And Jerusalem he ruled, he ruled for thirty-three years upon all of Israel and Judah. And the king David went with all his men to Jerusalem, to the Jebusite city. Uh, those who were sitting in the land, they said to David, Behold, you will not come here. Even the lame and the blind will throw you out of here. And David still came. And David captured the fortress of Zion, and he called it the city of David. And David said on that day, All who attack the, the Jebusites and go through the tunnel, he will be the one that attack. And so it was uh, that David dwelt in the city of the, in the fortress of, of Zion, and he called it the city of David, and he built upon it and was surrounded upon it. Uh, David, uh, so how did, he, just how, did he, how did he capture Jerusalem? We talked about a tunnel. Did you hear the word tunnel over there? We talked about a tunnel. How did he capture it? It is the most probable, but it's not for sure, that David and his men went through a secret tunnel that was in Jerusalem. You saw that in the movie? They went through this tunnel over here. Do you see the tunnel behind over here? It is most probable that if there's a tunnel that he actually went through, this is the tunnel that David's men went through. They climbed through underwater as like uh, as like Navy SEALs. As they made their way underwater, they were captured out here, went through this very this very tunnel over here to make their way. To understand what we're talking about, guys. This is a natural water so this over here is a well. Okay? The women know the job of the women to cap to get the water. They take their take their buckets down this path that you just went through with yourself. They'll then take their bucket, throw it down the water, and then pull the water up and go out to the city, this being a natural water source of the Gifon, of the Gifon Spring. David and his men most probably use this area, and I say most probably, because we don't know for sure, but most probably use this exact well to climb through, like the Navy Seals, to climb over and out over here to get himself into the city, to go over the city walls and to make his way into the middle of the city to capture Jerusalem. Any questions so far? You are now literally surrounded by Eretz Yisrael. You are literally walking through the steps of your forefathers. Let's make our way. 